made, it's like a broken record. We've said mm -hmm. it a gazillion times. We desperately need the rain, but there's none in sight, right? No, not really. We, we can see some well to our west, and it's mm -hmm. so close. We want it to get here. It's just, it doesn't look like it's going to happen. Somebody needs, yeah. Mother Nature needs to squeeze out the rag. I'm we're, just we're, saying. <laughs> we're trying. We're trying. A, a few clouds outside right now and another warmer than average day ahead for the start of your work week. Temperatures already warming up into the mid-70s. Average high for this time of year, 69 degrees, way over that. 76 Birmingham, 74 Anniston, 77 right now in Tuscaloosa. We've got the clouds. We just don't have any of the rain, any of the moisture in the mid-levels of the atmosphere to squeeze out some showers. Plenty of it, though, from Texas through Louisiana, Arkansas, the Midwest. They've got plenty of it, and it's so close. You would think the atmosphere would modify just a little bit, and some of this would head this way. It's just not going to happen. We see some showers. In Mississippi, starting to gather later this afternoon, but that's all we're going to see. That's as close as it's most likely going to get, maybe the northern part of Alabama. Temperatures drop into the 40s and upper, upper 40s and low 50s by tomorrow morning. When we hang on to the cloud cover for Election Day, but temperatures still on the milder side of things, low 70s for afternoon highs. It's this cold front they're going to be watching, and this area of high pressure will be the two big main players. All this rain stays to our west. We have the high pressure influencing us, and that keeps us mainly dry. The cold front moves through, and that's the best time we're going to see. Maybe we squeeze out a shower or two late on Tuesday, early on Wednesday. But after that, dry air moves back in, and those rain chances just evaporate. The rain is so close, it's just not going to get here. Storm track seven day forecast. Election day should be nice with a partly cloudy sky. Temperatures back in the mid 70s. A little cooler for Wednesday as the front passes. And then nice for Veterans Day for the parade at least. Not going to rain on the parade. Temperatures cooling off Saturday and Sunday. But unfortunately, no rain in that formal forecast for the next seven days, Jamie.